like to play, have a passion to, to, to work. And I think it's the difference, because some players live with some skills, but don't work hard to improve, because they, ha they think they, it's, it's enough. And for Ronaldo, it's not enough. He had the name, he had the focus to be the best in the world since uh, he was a kid. Would he say that? Yeah, I will be the best player in the world. developing a trick to beat a defender. all the TV cameras, all the rest of it. Develop it there when I've done that, we step up a level. And then, at the end, he developed them skills at such an high level that he could play anywhere in the world and that's why he's worth so much money. Seeing this, this lad get the ball and just quick feet and beat Shazy and get across or get shot off, and he sort of suddenly stood, you know, sat up on the bench and woke up and went, Whoa, what have we just seen there? And then you sort of half giggling at the players who are on the pitch because you're on the bench and you don't have to face this lad who's just terrorising the whole team. There's good players and there's Man United players and Ronaldo was a Man United player. Proclaimed by Sir Alex Ferguson as one of the most exciting young players he's ever seen, the Manchester United boss urged on by his players has moved quickly to capture the signature of Portuguese teenage sensation Cristiano Ronaldo.
Right, first of all, the massive breaking news today. It happened around half nine this morning. Manchester United announced they've accepted a world record bid of £80 million from Real Madrid to sign Cristiano Ronaldo. Let's go!